Year 10, welcome back to GCSE. Um, and yeah, for the majority of you, it's going to be welcome back to GCSE because a lot of schools do start those GCSEs in year nine now. And this is a really, really nice year because this is the year you get to spend learning GCSEs without too much pressure. The, the pressure the year 11s were just under. And if you're not sure about the pressure the year 11s were under, then go and look at the results day videos, read the comments on there and kind of see how they did. Because what we want to do is to make sure that you are feeling okay, that you are feeling ready, that you're not feeling too freaked out about um, what is coming up. And there are lots and lots of things that you can do now to make sure by the time we get to Easter in year 11, you're feeling a lot better about yourself. I'm talking about things just keeping on top of your work. So if you miss a lesson or if there's something you don't understand, then just make sure you keep on top of it. Make sure you kind of like, Catch up with that work, if there's anything you don't understand, go revise it a week later. Little and often is the way to go with this. Doing like 10 minutes of maths every single day is gonna be much better than having to do a whole day of learning algebra when we get to Easter of year 11. So little and often is the way to go. And then to help you with the little and often, over my website there are thousands of multiple choice questions for you. That'll help you with your classwork, that'll help you with your 10 exams, that'll help you with your year 11 exams, and you can start using these now. These are really low stakes, really low pressure questions that nobody can set for you, nobody can check up on you, but they will help you learn stuff. Also over my website, there is the free revision guide for you to download so that you can just keep up with what you're doing. Make sure you can tick stuff off as you're going along try to make yourself a revision timetable this is really really important but you can probably get away with only half following it in year 10. keeping on top of your homework keeping up with stuff that you didn't really understand that is the most important thing you can be doing at the moment so good luck guys um gcse's are fun gcse's are exciting i know you don't necessarily believe me um but i'm gonna be here with you every single step of the way